A slow start for UCLA in its season opener against Ohio State, but the Bruins finally steady the ship and win it going away. End up with 49s in three different rotations, 196-250. It's a low mark, but it is the first of the season, and it will get better for the sixth-ranked Bruins. We know that Kyler Ross was in midseason form, 399s, and started with a 9-8 on vault. She had a good, solid Yurchenko layout, full performance. I'd like to see her find the landing and find the stick, but again, that's me being picky because there is not that much to deduct off of Kyla Ross, especially from this bar routine right here. She found the stick and always beautiful to watch on beam, finishing with a gainer side aerial back layout full and on the floor double pike and that has been her nemesis last year and look how happy Jordan Weber is it was a really big feat for the whole team and Kyla Ross 39-5 to win the all-around Christine Peng Peng Lee was only on two events but she made them count solid again on the landing didn't have much time to train this week because she was sick but she doesn't need that much time to train apparently double full on the beam and finishing with a new dismount side aerial to a layout Full. So Lee ends up winning the bars with a 9975. She posts a 9925 on balance beam. So she's on the top step on both of those events. Pauline Trotz wins the vault for UCLA 985, the two time German national vault champion. That's big for UCLA. She also anchored floor, started with a big full in, legs glued together. She has phenomenal technique, and we're going to see her a lot this season. So, not a big score, but a win is a win. The Bruins are 1 0, and now it's on to Reno for the Elevate the Stage quad meet against rivals Utah, Stanford, and Washington.